In the last few years, the 3D printing industry has exploded, reaching more than $22 billion in market size. So, people are interested in turning their 3D creations and models into real-life objects, and this is made even easier with the latest 3D printer technology. Now it is easier than ever to get a 3D printer for a really low price. And as for what to print, numerous websites have been popping out offering a long list of 3D printable models like Thingiverse, My Mini Factory, and Thanks, which we already talked about in this channel. But today we're gonna take a look at Reality Cloud. This website offers a huge library of ready 3D models with a ton of variety and detail in addition to an amazing way to inspect and keep track of every piece and part of the model, along with a couple of new features. With that being said, this video was sponsored by Reality Cloud and their new upcoming printer modification event, which we're gonna talk about later in the video. So, Creality Cloud is an all-in-one 3D platform aimed at everyone interested in finding great models, as well as tools and resources to embark on your 3D printing journey. On the creator side of things, the 3D model marketplace offers a long list of high-quality models. Creality Cloud actually provides a platform for makers to sell their original 3D designs and will get a 90% commission from their sales, which is interesting. So, it is a 3D models marketplace, but the amazing thing is that the website offers a ton of other features that you might not find in other websites, like for instance, the built-in 3D slicing software and the support for remote control printing, in addition to remote video monitoring, personalized creative modeling tools, just to name a few. Creality Cloud offers a cloud-based slicing feature that allows you to slice your 3D models online directly from the comfort of your browser or even on your phone. Slicing, if you are not familiar with 3D printing, is not as you may think, just cutting a big model into smaller chunks for easy printing, but rather converting the whole model from a 3D model into a set of instructions. These instructions are called a G-code file. The 3D printer actually works similar to a normal printer. However, it can print multiple layers. So, it slices the model into thin layers and further determines how each layer should be printed. This also will take into consideration the best time and best structure integrity or strength for the print, in addition to other stuff. Creality Cloud makes it very easy for beginners to get good results, as the default settings should be more than enough. All you need to do is to pick the device type and the material you are using. The sliced file will be saved to the cloud automatically, and you can also save it to the local machine you have. Another major benefit of using Creality Cloud is that it also provides a mobile version to control your 3D printing remotely. No longer do you need to be present in front of your printer to click something every time you need to start your printing. Furthermore, it gives you the ability to set up your model and slice it easily however you see fit through the web application, which is really cool. And it is a great and fantastic time saver. So you can start and stop prints, adjust settings, and of course monitor the progress of your prints from anywhere using your smartphone. This is particularly extremely useful, especially if you are away from your printer or maybe your house and you want to store the print remotely and monitor the printing process in real time. On the creator side of things, because Creality Cloud is a marketplace, it allows you also to sell your 3D design by becoming a designer on Creality Cloud so you can upload and share your models and even make money. The submitted content will be reviewed by the website team. After that, it will be added to the marketplace, with you receiving up to 90% commission from your sales, which is a great way to make some bucks on the side. Now, last week, Reality Cloud announced their printer modification event. As we mentioned before, Creality are also the manufacturer of a long list and versatile 3D printer lineup, such as the enclosed Sermoon and its variations, also resin-based Highlight Mage and the M4 and Smart Pro. But this competition is aimed at the enclosed popular model K1 and K1 Max. If you are in the 3D printing scene, you have probably at least heard of the K1 printers. They come with a ton of features for a really competitive price. But that's a subject for another video. 
What I want to tell you about here is their latest printer modification competition which, as the name suggests, is a call to all 3D designers and 3D printer enthusiasts to try and create the best custom K1 and K1 Max modification such as but not limited to extruders, print beds, frames and so on. So basically something that has to do with the function of the printer itself. The competition has started on October 27th and the final day to upload your designs is gonna be on the 30th of November. You can upload as many entries as you want. The competition will feature 20 generous prizes for the first top 20 participants which will include up to $300 in cash, 3D printer filament and premium memberships. But not only that, because all the participants in the competition can earn to up to 1000 Kova coins by simply uploading their model, which can be redeemed for free filament and other supplies. So if you think this is down your alley and you are interested in participating in the event, click the first link in the description to learn more about the event itself. Also, let's talk about the exciting limited time promotion from Creality Cloud. They are currently running a special offer that you don't want to miss. So visit their website to find more about this fantastic opportunity. And if you are looking to enhance your 3D printing experience and save some money, make sure to check it out. Finally, Creality Cloud seems like a great platform for 3D printing enthusiasts. It does feel a little bit rough on the edges, in my opinion. And it is worth mentioning that Creality does make 3D printers as well. However, this wasn't mentioned in the video. Still, the service can be reviewed in future videos once we have the opportunity to get a Creality Cloud 3D printer, where we will be getting a full experience and seeing what it can do. Now, I want to pass the question off to you. Have you tried Creality Cloud before? And have you used their services and products? What was your takeaway? And what was your experience to share it with us? I hope you guys found this video useful and informative. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. You can also take a look at some of our previous videos. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next one.